but are CGMs really needed and is it worth the hype created? First, let's talk about the accuracy of CGM vis-a-vis -vis glucometers and venous blood. So, venous blood which is taken in the lab is most accurate. Capillary blood taken from the fingers through a glucometer is next level accuracy and CGMs tend to be lesser accurate than both of these because they are picking up from the fluid in between the cells. So especially if there is a lot of fluctuating in sugars, you may not get very accurate responses. Also, we've been managing diabetics for the last 11 years. 16,000 people are free without CGMs. And we have found that whenever people take on to CGMs, usually the sugars show 10 to 15% less. So at times your decisions to change medications are not that accurate.